16 years after a ban came into effect, hostilities around fox hunting continue. Police officers in Kent have launched an investigation after a confrontation between saboteurs and the East Kent hunt with West Street. And just a warning that Tony Green's report contains footage that some viewers may find distressing. This is footage taken from the Hunt Saboteur Association. They describe their aims as saving hunted wildlife and recording illegal hunting activity. This is what they recorded outside Canterbury, hounds surrounding the bloodied body of a fox. There was nothing we could do. Um, the animal's, the animal's uh, body was still pulsating and it was warm. You know, there was steam coming off it. It's the most horrendous thing to see. And um, in the six years that I've been volunteering for the Hunt Sabs, I've sadly seen many kills. Uh, they never get easier. Uh, this was a particularly bad one because we were so close to it. The East Kent with West Street Hunt says it wasn't hunting a fox, but it was trail hunting that day where hounds follow a scent. Both they and the saboteurs described one another's behaviour as aggressive and there were confrontations throughout the day. In a statement, a Hunt spokesperson said there were no members of Hunt staff or any Hunt officials present during the time of the alleged incident, and it doesn't seem clear what the circumstances were. However, we believe that the incident could have been caused almost entirely by the actions of the saboteurs who distracted the hounds and turned the wild mammal back into the path of the pack. Saboteurs say the fox had been hunted all day. Police confirmed they were called to a disturbance on land near Ash and are now investigating an alleged breach of the Hunting Act as well as other offences that may have been committed. Tony Green, ITV News.